We're going to begin our quick start video series by giving you a broad overview of the functional layout and features available in the G7 Long Range Ballistic Program. Uh, all the inputs are quantified and gathered up into functional tabs that are descriptive for the different segments. The first tab is the load tab and it has information about your rifle and ammunition that you're shooting, ballistic coefficient, muzzle velocity, etc. The next tab is the environment tab. Now this tab is a uh, inputs for your different environmental conditions or if you're using a bullet drop compensator. The, the next tab is the sight tab and the sight tab includes your wind inputs, your wind for multiple uh, winds for your fire solution calculation, your target speed and direction, and your incline. Now once you've got the first three tabs filled out completely then you can jump to your output tabs which is your chart tab which gives you your drop solution, in this case in minutes of angle, versus your range. Also includes your wind, spin drift, lead, and if we scroll over you've got other calculations like your velocity and energy. Uh, the final output tab is your fire solution tab. Now in this one we can calculate your shoot to range if you're using a BDC uh, based on your target distance. Uh, it also outputs the drop in clicks or whichever unit you select and your other uh, corrections that you need to make. This last tab is your number tab and that is your target number tab. This device will save uh, all your loads and all of your different targets. For, in this, for this situation we've got the Gunworks target range set up uh, at a thousand yards and it stores all of your information for that target range. Your compass heading, your uh, inclination, your wind, etc. Uh, when you do save a load, uh, that load information is uh, m basically all the information on your load tab. Uh, it also includes your spin drift information as well. Now spin drift is one of the advanced options and in this uh, menu you can look up a bullet and that will populate your ballistic coefficient value if you don't have the BC on your bullet box. You can also look up uh, your load from many of the popular loads that are listed in that database and that will populate your BC and your muzzle velocity uh, inputs. Finally there's your spin drift settings for your spin drift calculation and your Coriolis settings. The last option here in the advanced features is the trajectory validation and that helps you match your exact uh, rifles trajectory up with your calculation. And now finally we have the help tab which allows you to uh, look up information for any of the different uh, tabs or settings and it'll tell you uh, what the inputs are and, and how to get the right information. If you need a little resource for uh, the background and the terminology, visit g7.com or gunworks.com. We have articles, we have videos, and, and some products that you can buy, like Brian Litz's book, Applied Ballistics, that will give you a research tool so that you can educate yourself on long-range shooting. For the G7 calculator, we have a support email set up, support at g7.com. Send us any technical questions, we'll respond as soon as possible. I'm Aaron Davidson. And that concludes our in-depth look at the G7 Long Range Ballistic Calculator.